Previously on the Digimon Tri Cup Season 2. Uh, we will promote Garumon up. Okay. Then we're gonna Digivolve into Garumon X Antibody to draw me a card. Er, Alright. And draw one, draw two. Uh, we'll trash Puppetmon and Piedmon down. I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> I'm leaving, dog. I'm leaving. What the fuck? Oh, come on, man. Hello, everyone. My name is Ben Ben, and this is the Digimon Tri Cup Season 2. With me and my good friend Kyle, aka Ride My Avatar, every video will bring in our own proxy decks. Up to date, whatever the latest support is available, and duke it out. Each video giving either of us a point, and the one with the most points after 15 weeks will win the entire series. Like last season, each video is going to be uploaded on either me or Kyle's channel, so be sure to subscribe to both so you don't miss out on any of the action. The Digimon Tri Cup 2. Let's see what kind of spicy decks we can brew. So guys, we won the last one with Apocalyptic Bond. Now we're gonna go right into basically what I would say is our final BT15 deck. We're gonna bring in none other than Metal Gurumon. Definitely this deck is OTK as can be. One of the decks that can handle Apocalyptic Bond because of its speed and tempo. The fact that we have all these cool engine pieces. One combo piece I really like is EX01 Gurumon for being able to play a three cost mat. So what we're going to be playing is our Matt Ishida that searches us the top three cards of deck. Add one Gabumon or Gurumon as name among them to your hand. Return the rest of the bottom deck, which will self-trigger Matt's effect when one of your Digimon effects adds a card to your hand by suspending the same or gaining memory. His effect won't self-fulfill his effect, but it just helps speed up the deck. So you grab pieces that way. But since we're going to be restanding, we're going to have draw. Then we have wear Gurumon promo. That is basically if this Digimon has a Gurumon as Digi Evolution, unsuspend it. The extra security check. We're gonna be tossing cards constantly, so our goal is if we lose a battle, at least we put our stuff back through our inheritables, like Gabumon X antibodies inheritable. When your Gurumon Omni would be deleted in battle, return two non DG egg cards from your trash to the bottom of the deck, prevent its deletion. We do that with the same thing with the Gurumon X antibody. The fact that we draw so many cards, we should be able to OTK faster than our opponent is ready for. Just all in all, good stuff. And then we have just in case we need to warp. We can, if we have a Tamer with Matt and your opponent has a Digimon with 10,000 DP or more, one of your Gabumon may Digivolve into this card, nor Digi Evolution requirements it has evade. Three of your opponent's Digimon and Tamers cannot suspend until the end of opponent's turn, and all turns when this Digimon becomes suspended, you may unsuspend this Digimon. All in all, great potential. This deck should seal us a lead that Ben Ben can't catch up. We are closing into those 15 weeks, and it's going to be a lot of fun. Let's get into it. He brought Apocalamon. He brought Apocalypse. Uh, while it is unfortunate that we were unable to win that one, I think that was still a pretty good showcase on the new cards from BT15 and how it supported Machine Jamon. In fact, had I known that he was playing the Wear Guru on Ace, I think we could have had that one. But alas, the past is the past, and it is time to bring out some new cards from BT15. And I think it's time to showcase a deck that I didn't think got a good chance to shine. It is time to bring back the Digi Police. Wee woo wee woo wee. That's right, the police are back yet again with a brand new line from BT15. The new Ryudamon and Gunrymon are excellent for the police strategy. Both of them having the inheritable effects of when this Digimon gets suspended, we are able to suspend one of our opponent's Digimon with the same play cost or lower. We didn't get a chance to showcase it and what it can do in Machine Digimon, but I'm hoping we had a chance to showcase it here. Now, since I mentioned them in the previous episode, I'm not going to go too much into detail for them, but for those of you who didn't see it, the Ryudamon has the effect of Strata Main Phase by taking a Shu Yulin from our hand and putting it underneath as a source. This Digimon is unaffected by Digimon effects until the end of opponent's turn, giving ourselves some much needed protection for in case we want to promote out early. And then Gendryumon being able to lock down one of our opponent's Digimon by suspending it, and if we have a Black Tamer underneath it, we can actually stun it for a turn. A much needed control tool that the D Brigade strategy didn't have before. But I think the coolest card from this entire line is definitely going to be the Hisariumon. Hisariumon having the main effect of Blocker, and when another Digimon gets suspended, while this Digimon has a Digipolice Tamer underneath it, we can Digivolve this card into a Beast Dragon or a Digipolice from our hand for free. And keep in mind that this is all turns, so that means that we're able to trigger our inheritable effects during our opponent's turn, whether we block or even if they try to suspend one of their own tamers or Digimon via effects, we are then going to be able to Digivolve into our top end for free, pretty much turning any of our level 6s into pseudo aces, without the overflow minusing. It also has the inheritable effect of whenever a other Digimon is suspended by an effect, we can unsuspend one of our other D brigades. It doesn't have to be itself, so that is very useful for giving some much needed pressure, but we can also trigger that effect ourselves as well, thanks to the effect of Shu Yulin. Shu Yulin being a set to 3 tamer herself, as we mentioned in the previous episode, but it also has the mind link effect of giving our Digimon alliance. 
Digimons, which as you know, suspends another Digimon in order to increase DP and give ourselves some security attack plus one. But that also ties into the brand new top end for this deck being the Oriumon. Now, Oriumon having the effect of when Digivolving, as long as it has a Digipolice Tamer underneath it, we are able to take one of our opponent's suspended Digimon and send it to the bottom of the deck. Meaning that if we are able to trigger this effect on our opponent's turn, whether they are attacking or we are able to use our own effects to suspend one of our opponent's Digimon or Tamers, we can send one of those respective cards to the bottom of the deck during the opponent's turn. Some pretty nasty disruption if you ask me. And it also has the all turns effect of when this Digimon gets suspended, we get to play a Beast Dragon or a Digipolice from our hand that is 5k DP or less for free. Giving us another way to swarm the board while also giving us another alliance target from Shu Yulin's effect. Now, I think it goes without saying if we are playing Digipolice, I think that the best course of action is to definitely run at least one Quartz Mon in the deck, as it is going to be able to stun our opponent down, and also because we swarm the board so much, we can easily mitigate the cost of evolution for the Quartz Mon as well. But since the deck is so good at going wide, I think that it has a perfect opportunity to fit in the EX4 Blitz Greymon, and of course we would have to fit a Ragnalormon to go with it. Blitz Greymon having the effect to be able to jogress one of our other level 6s, but it also has the very nifty effect of choosing 3 Digimon and de digivolving it by 3. Something that I think that D-Brigade kind of lacks, without using option cards. And of course, Ragnalormon just being a solid finisher all around. Is this deck going to be enough to put us back in the running? Who knows? It's time to find out. Start us off. We're going to hatch. We're going to go Kyokyomon. Kyokyomon's going to evolve into Ryudamon. Draw a card. I think this time we're actually going to play Black Memory Boost. Giving you three. I'll check the top four cards in my deck here. I'll take the Brigade Jumon to hand this time around. These three go to bottom deck. Turn's yours. Uh, we'll hatch Boko. We'll Digivolve into Gabu to draw me a card. We're going to go put Matt Ishida down at one card. We're going to add the Garurumon X Mental Training. One, Sounds two. Uh, we'll grab the Matt Ishida here. Good cards are good. Nice. Go I will draw. I think we'll go two costs into High Commander here, actually. Okay. Draw a card. And the best play now is... Put him down your Tamer, right? I sure wish I drew one. <laughs> <laughs> We're just going to go Black Memory Boost again. Give me three. I'll check yep. the top four cards in my deck. One, two, three, and four. Ooh, ooh Blitz Graham onto hand. Uh, these three will go to bottom deck. Okay. Turns yours. Promote the Gabu up. Skill of Gabu. Start a main. Heal game blocker. Will also draw me a card because I have a Matt Ishida. Oh, he just does that? That's really good. <laughs> yeah! We'll pop the mental. We'll Digivolve into Garurumon here to draw me a card. Very nice. Then we will Digivolve for to draw me a card. Skill of when Digivolving, draw one, draw two. Trash two cards. Uh, we'll trash the Garurumon here. Trash a Mad Ishida. Do I swing now? Yeah, I have jamming. Why am I? That's. <laughs> Draw for Guru, draw for Gabu. Matty should uh, suspend, gain a memory. All right, I'll do a check. Training. Play Gabumon down. We're going to look at sure. the top three cards. We'll have this weird Guru Mon here. Mm -hmm. And then we'll go for a free evolution into Gabu X. Reveal top four. One, two, three, and four. We'll grab the metal Guru Mon Ace. And then we'll Digivolve for two into Garurumon to draw me a card. If I have a Tamer with Mashiasia, draw a card. And then we'll Digivolve into Garurumon X to draw me a card. Gosh damn, so many. <laughs> draw two, trash this wear Guru, metal Garurumon X antibody. You're at one. Mental training. Gabumon. Sounds good. Go ahead. All right, I will draw. I mean, I think we just have to promote up and hope for the best, right? I think we just hope for the best. If I drew a tamer just now, I would have felt really good, but I didn't. <laughs> Use defense training to evolve into Shoryu for one. Draw a card. The bitch showed up, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to crack two memory boots now. I don't think I think too hard about this. I think I have to go right into the Brigade Gemon now for four. Draw a card here. On evolution, I will be deleting the... I'll delete the standing guru X, actually. Okay. The best I can do is try to swing at the Guru X antibody as well. It doesn't have the Gabumon protection underneath, does it? Nope. Okay. Yeah, so we'll be swinging at the rested Guru X. Counter timing. Yeah. Draw skill. I have to trash a card. We'll trash Omnimon. Gurumon X's skill. We're going to take both the X antibodies that you just made me use up and bottom deck. We'll play a commander down. We have the top three cards on my deck from the brigade. I will bring out shoe plus commander down. Commander's effect. I will be the top five cards on my deck. Carbridge on the hand. Yep. 
order will be like this. Exactly like this. And that's it. Turn's yours. Draw the turn. Unsuspend. Hatch. Gobblemon to draw me a card. So I'm at three. I think we're going to go with X antibody here. Where Gurumon Ace will swing in. Gurumon's effect to draw me a card. Skill of Matt Ishida. Gain me a memory. Skill of this where Gurumon will stun your Commandermon that will be on death. Gabumon, <laughs> draw me a card. X antibody evolution. We're gonna go into where Grumon X, and then we're gonna discard two cards. We're gonna discard Metal Grumon Ace, and I think mm -hmm. we're gonna discard Gabumon X antibody. Skill, he unsuspends. We'll grab Metal Grumon X antibody back to my hand. He unsuspends. Okay. And yeah. Since the you did unsuspend, Kyo Kyo will allow me to draw a card. And then uh, he saw his effect. Since a effect suspended a Digimon or Tamer, I'll choose one of my Digipolice and unsuspend it. I will unsuspend uh, what the brigade. Suspend? Uh, you're met. Oh, okay. <laughs> I will then choose to block with the Brigade Mon here. Using the Ryudamon's effect, I will suspend your Murguru X. Take these, put it there. Pop mental training. We're gonna go into Metal Gurumon here. Oh, the new one. Yep. Nice. So this one basically has evaded and when evolving three of your opponents, Digimon and Tamers cannot suspend until the end opponent's turn. It'll be Shu and that Commandermon and the Brigadermon. Okay, I so get these three. three. Cool. Yep. I'm gonna Digivolve into Metal Gurumon X Antibody to unsuspend. Okay. Both Commandermons get bounced. Very rude. We're going to swing jamming with Metal Gurumon X Antibody. We will trash one card to unsuspend myself. And because of his effect... Oh, wait. I've already done this. It's once per turn. Oh, okay. One check. Uh, one uh, check. Jamming. You do have your jamming. You're fine. <laughs> Gurumon does draw me a card. Gurumon <laughs> X Antibody to draw me a card. It's um, fine by me. I'm going to... So I'll go for it. Yeah, go for it here. You draw another one? Yeah, draw another one. We check. He shout you. It's all good. I'm going to play blue Membos down. Reveal top four. Oh, wow. One, two, three, four. We'll grab the nice. Guru. Okay. I can't swing, but I'm allowed to unsuspend, right? Yeah, you just can't suspend yourself. Rude. I will draw for turn at least. Uh, we'll hatch into a Kyokyo. -Kyo. Yep. Kyokyo -Kyo will evolve into Ryuda. I draw a card. Mm -hmm. Okay, here. We're going to go three for Commandra. Going down to zero. That's a, these are some good cards. <laughs> We get the Oryu to hand, and this order can actually stay exactly as is. We're going to Mind Link with the Commandra here, and we're just going to have to go two costs into the Ginryumon. I'm giving you two. I draw a card. On Evolution, do get to stun your Melga X. So we cannot unsuspend, period, until the end of your next turn. And then finally, at the end of turn, I reveal top three. I will play these two down. Ragnar does get trashed, unfortunately, but I think yep. that's okay with me. I will demine link the Shu Yulin. Uh, but that is it. Yes, your turn. Unsuspend. Draw. We'll promote up. Did you offer two to draw me a card? Yeah, I think I can combo. Oh, that's disappointing. <laughs> we'll digivolve into Gurumon X Antibody to draw. Gil will draw two. Mm -hmm. We'll trash a Gurumon. We'll trash a Gurumon at this point. Rush Mash Ishida, gain a memory. So I am at two now, right? Yep, you're back to two. Any effects from your end? Oh, actually, let me double check. Isaru, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, there's a mandatory trigger. So unfortunately, I don't get to use Isaru anymore this turn. Okay. We'll put an X antibody underneath. We'll pop the mem boost. We'll digivolve into where. We're going to go where Gurumon's going to swing. Skill of Gurumon, draw me a card. Once return of Gabu, draw me a card. No X antibody evolution, but we will do the Gurumon. When attacking skill, we will trash one card. We'll trash the Matt Ishida to unsuspend myself. And do you have jamming or no jamming? Yes, I do. <laughs> okay, okay, so just making sure, just making sure. I'll do a secure check. Uh, Quartz, you have jamming anyway. I'll digivolve into where Gurumon X antibody to draw me a card. Question is if I can get rid of the third or not. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, wait. Is the reason why you're contemplating so hard or just because you have two cards left in deck? Yeah. I just realized. <laughs> yeah, that's why. Oh, uh, I wasn't even paying attention to that. Oh, wow. Okay, shit. Yeah. Hmm. That's, that's okay. a big 
question mark here. You go through your deck that fast? This is crazy! Yeah, I think the smart play, not the risky bullshit play right now. I think the <laughs> smart play is what we have to do. Play Gobblemon down, giving you your three. Fair enough. Go ahead. I right, get one get to win with deck out, huh? All right, fair enough. I'll promote Rita up. We'll use Rita's effect to slide Shu underneath. So now he, she is unaffected by Digimon effects until the end of your next turn. Shu Yulin will go underneath this Ginryu here. Mm -hmm. And we will actually evolve into another Isariumon here. Yep. I mean, I guess we just gotta try to push, right? We're gonna have Brigagemon swing into security. Ryuta's effect will allow me to suspend one of your Digimon or Tamers up to equal to his play cost or lower. I will suspend Weirgurumon X antibody. That does trigger the Hisariumon's effect as well, which allows me to evolve into the Oryumon this time around. Draw a card. And then that triggers the Hisaryu as well again. I will unsuspend the Brigade. And Oryumon's on evolution will send the we'll send the melga x to bottom deck so that way i have overflow three okay did you evolve into last days to draw skill nice. rule, trash blue memboost and mental training because at this point they are not going to do anything uh, we will do one more card at least. Oh, okay. Where Sounds Gurumon. Good. I guess we're gonna have to keep trying. <laughs> Oryu is gonna swing in. We're gonna swing into the Melga. And when attacking, I will be using its effect. When it gets suspended, I play a Beast Dragon or Digi Police that's 5k or less. I will choose to bring out this Commandjamon here. And then, of course, I will be using uh, the Ginryu effect to suspend the Gabu now. Yep. And then, due to that effect, uh, he saw you effect will trigger again, allowing me to unsuspend the Oryu now. And this is just a 12k. Two He's protection. saving his deck. Yeah. Nice. You only have two protections, right? Yeah. I mean, I guess I'll try to swing at it again for 12k. Um, yeah, that works. We'll do Metal Gurumon and Gabumon here. Alright. Third time's the charm. Brigade will swing over the Milga once and for all. Yep. And we'll go to four. Ryuda's gonna swing in the Gabu this time for 2k. Sure. And then we'll go training to going down to two. Real top two. Another shoe. We'll get the shoe to hand. This goes to the mm -hmm. bottom deck here. Just hard play Comandra, giving you one. And Brigade's effect will reveal top three. Uh, we'll play out the cargo, trash the rest, and then cargo's effect will reveal top three. Play the Satsuki. These sure. get trashed. Turns yours. Reboot. Hatch. Digi. Draw. Did you go for free to draw? And play Gabumon down, check top three. Yep. We'll grab the Metal Gurumon. Go ahead. Bring up the Shuyulin, so I'm going back to three. And then I'll draw off a turn. Uh, we hatch into another Kill Kill. Satsuki will guarantee me four. We'll use Ruda's effect first. I will put the Shuyulin back in for its effect. We won't play with our food anymore. We're just going to swing for 1k. Kermandra. Maddy Shida. Grab the ace. Alrighty. Uh, we'll go Kermandra number two. Gabu. I'm dead. I reveal top three. Uh, no commandras. That goes to the bottom deck here. All right, immobile we'll swing. Two k. I'm dead. Uh, swing four k. Take it. I'm dead. And then Ryuta will swing. Sure. Whew. Well, that was a close one. It was honestly insane what Kyle was able to do with the Melga X. The jamming from the Bukumon gave it so much early attack pressure, and the draw power from the Guru Engine, as we saw from Kyle, was able to go through practically his entire deck. Huh. Maybe it does make sense the way they hit those cards, but that does make that 9 points for me. We are unfortunately still behind against Kyle, but we are catching up. Tune in next episode to find out if we do. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye everybody.